Hey all this loving universe, it's Xander, welcome back to Fire Emblem Fates. Xenolog. Boo Camp. Allow me to explain. Lady Court, I am concerned with how strong our opposition has become. If you will permit my opinion, then I believe we should bolster our own strength to match. Right. It's not a bad idea, but I don't see how. Then it's fortunate that I have been sterling planned to revitalize our forces. Huh? Oh yeah? Yes. I propose that we all embark on a test of courage together. What? Almost dreading the answer to this, but... What exactly does a test of courage involve? Allow me to explain. My, my, you really did lead a sheltered upbringing. There has been a talk of peculiar monsters prowling a haunted peak in another world. The test of courage comes in spending a night upon that mountain. They say that almost none survive, but those who do come back changed. Hmm? That sounds like a hoary ghost, hoary old ghost story to me. <laughs> Indeed it does. I don't believe a word of it. Then why did you bring it up? My apologies, I thought that on the slight chance it was real, it could be of good use for us. What harm could it do to go and find out the truth at the root of the rumors? At worst, we spend the night in the cold. At best, we discover a new strength. Understood. Fine. If it will satisfy your curiosity, let's go and get this over with. At this point, I'll take any suggestions to boost our strength, however outlandish. Really, Much obliged, Lady Corrin. This is the so-called Haunted Mountain, eh? Yes. So it would seem. Hmm. Grr. It's a bit chilling to a hold, isn't it? Oh. One might say too chilling, even. I'm regretting my enthusiasm for coming here. It might be best if we return to camp before something unfortunate happens. No. In due time. First, we've got to prove our metal here in the mountain. What, what you... you can't possibly be serious. Well... Why not? I generally feel that training here is a good idea. Even if these ridiculous, unusual monsters are fake, the mountain layer will do us good. The mountain air. Uh, are you seeing the same soupy fog that I am? But no matter, it shall be as you say, Lady Corn. Right. Don't worry about it. I'm sure everything will be fine. Huh. Funny how often one he hears that before tragedy strikes. Be ready for the worst, everyone. Cool, so we get a team of 12. And I think these are all strong enemies that don't hit for much. I want to see where that conversation is going. So it's just root the enemy. Ah, so you're the fearsome monster, Jacob Engine, eh? You startled me. I'll give you that, but the truth isn't so scary. Now to see if vanquishing you will win in fact make me stronger. Well, glad we got that other seal. This is my... What I always fear what I always feared, more than any apparition or specter. It was the time I ran across my father in the halls at night. If I hadn't been out of bed for honest reasons, things might have been bad. Xander, do I want to know? I don't really think I do. Oh. I know many places far more terrifying than the silly old haunted mountain. For instance, the mansion of the dead deep in the woods of the Forlorn. Or the Carnival, a glade of trees that eat people whole. Oh, the games we played there when I was a girl. Camilla, you scare me. But I like it. I'm not afraid of the dark or haunted mountains or that monster over there. What did you get there? Get it away! Get it away! Oh, I'll talk to me. Okay, so we're getting some experience out of it. Nothing special, but yeah. hey, it's experience is experience. Seventeen plus fourteen, I believe, is actually 
31. Had to do the math in my head there. I considered myself courageous, but this place is still so oppressive. But I can't let my little sister down. I need to put on a brave face. I enjoy basking the envy that the dead harbor for the living. It's the second only to the envy that most of the living feel towards me. I have never shrunk from the test of courage, not even at a young age. But I'd rather you didn't appear suddenly from behind to surprise me. Wonderfully ghastly place. So delightfully dreary. But I could do without the grotesque beasts that won't bend to my will. You, return to whence you came at once or become my new test subject. And you're out of here. Am I scared? Of course not. A man of my bloodline must push aside. Gods, my legs are shaking so wildly that maybe I'm not fit to be a king. Oh, yikes. Ready to hear the noise. Huh. Oh, hell. That's a lot more. No, um, Corin doesn't need that. Corin's max level. So let's have Hinoka do it. Because my god, Hinoka needs experience. For some reason, she has become, like, somehow the weakest of the siblings that aren't the healers. Just keep Brynhildr out. If only we could do this in more mystical location, under a fading moon. Alas, we're merely battling monsters by the glow of top with fire wisps. Did she seriously miss? Come on, Ophelia! It's not that hard! Thank you, Ryoma. Really? Well, Ryan was almost max leveled, meaning I'll need to get another 12,000 gold. That is the one downside about this, is that everyone's almost max level for where they can be before I have to start grinding for gold. At this point, it's literally just becoming me doing this, so. I don't want Moe Breaker, honestly.
So this literally is just a gauntlet of survival. It's not it's not bad. Getting some good experience out of it, Lee. He's probably going to get some supports out of it. Well, like, it's a really good spot for experience, but, I mean, there's nothing special about it. It literally is just, oh, oh look at me, I'm doing damage to monsters. Monsters that, you know, they do some damage, but not enough. Can't kill me. Everything's okay. okay, Takumi, you're level 17. If you don't get that up close attack thing, I'm gonna be pissed. Also, I have to start shaving, I have to start trimming my mustache back or something, because, like, if I close my mouth, I have to be careful, because part, part of my mustache goes into my mouth, and it's gross. Seventeen, seventeen. that's 34. That's perfect, actually. That'll one-shot. There you go, ladies. Good job. Good double-team. and pursue this one on her own. Oh, hell, I didn't expect that. I don't know why I didn't expect that. How many are we at now? Ten enemies again? How often is this going to go? Until every grave goes off or something? It's not even difficult, like I said. It's just kind of agitating at this point. It's boring. I'm trying to find things to talk about, but I've been doing this for a quarter of a year. Let that sink in. I've been playing Fire Emblem Fates on YouTube for a whole quarter of the year. Granted, we are very close to the end. Like, very, very close to the end. But we're not at the end yet. I don't know why I thought that was going to work. Do that. There. And corn. Yeah, I had a feeling corn would go down, so. My bad. And there's more. Oh, whoops, Doc Me's in murky water. Guys, I didn't realize that was an effect. Neat. Megan's a progress still. level. Mm. Oh god! Sorry, buddy. Uh, my dog, Major, is in the bedroom uh, at this point because it's almost one in the morning. And he was sound asleep and the speaker got caught. Like, the wires for the speaker got caught and fell and the poor little guy just got woken up by it. And so now he is chewing his butt. As he does. He was sound asleep, and now he's just awake and chewing on his own ass. Dogs, what are you gonna do, you know?
There we go. Would have been nice if, um, you know, that worked. Yeah, go ahead and take him out. And you're out of here. How long does this go for? Like, it almost looks like that little sigil up there does something. Because it's a green dot on the map. If you see that. I'm um, highlighting it on the bottom screen. It almost makes me think that if I, if I push my way towards them, it'll do something. Because they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. And they've pushed our little team almost all the way together now. Camilla, come on, girl. I need you. I was gonna say I need her to step it up, but she is kind of overpowered as it is. Oh, jeez. I think they know I'm getting close. Good job, Takumi. Two more levels, Takumi, and then you're maxed out. So if you'd like to get some strange ability that lets you shoot arrows from one space away, you got literally two more chances to get it before I get a little bit annoyed. Also, I am throwing hands with these monsters, and I am getting my ass kicked now. This is actually going on a lot longer than I thought it would. I'm running out of things to talk about, and I'm probably going to bed after this one, because it is almost 1 in the morning. I'm pretty much only recording right now, because, um... Pretty much I'm only recording right now, because I have two videos uploading, and I want to turn my computer off, because I haven't turned my computer off in a few days. Okay, no, we can't even go up here at the sigil. So I think we do have to literally kill all these. Hope, boy, this last batch is like their last hurrah, because they spawn so many at once. Like, maybe that's our last surprise. Is, you know, so many of them. I don't know what's going on with Rajat's accuracy, but it's the absolute worst right now. Why did I do Tiger Spirit? What was I thinking?
Yeah, the answer was I probably wasn't thinking. There you go, Camilla. Hey, she's leveled up three out of the five times she can right now. She's probably going down in a second here, but... How the hell is she still alive? I have no explanation for how Camilla has stayed alive this whole time. Okay, Takumi, you better get it now, or you've got one more level. I'm starting to think he just doesn't get it, and that maybe he only gets it. I'm really starting to think he only gets it when he's that enemy. When he's, like, your enemy in Conquest. If that's the case, I'm a little bit annoyed by that fact. out of it, Sigbert, little mini Xander over there. It's weird being named Xander in real life, having a character in this game named Xander, and having a son who looks just like him. Tom Ock, this guy. I mainly said that in hopes Takumi would get a crit, but, you know. Doesn't always work like that sometimes. Okay. I think this is coming to the end. I mean, I can finally go to bed in a minute here. I should have gone to bed hours ago. I should have gone to bed, like, when I beat the game at 7 in the evening. Yeah, it wasn't 7, it was more like 10. Her magic is almost off the chart. That's it! Boo camp is complete. It felt like it took forever, but it only took 20 minutes. It literally is as long as the last episode. Seems you heard your head right. You that It seems you heard right. That was a hard-won victory. I hadn't quite, I hadn't expected quite that many foes. I've quite the, had my fill on this mountain. Point taken. May want to rest up before coming back here. I'm sorry. Did I did I hear you say come back? Why not? Seems like an ideal training exercise. Everyone came out stronger for it. I must thank you again for coming to me with the idea. Of course, Lady Corin. I'd follow you to the ends of the earth or up a haunted mountain, apparently. I knew I could rely on you, Jacob. But having scalded this ghastly peak, let us make our way back down post-haste. I will put up a pot of tea for you as soon as we return to camp. How does that sound? Hey! 34 hours. Okay. Anna's so cute. I love her. We've done this one because that's when she prepares the quiz. He prepares the quiz for her, and she aces it. I've not seen that one. Have seen this one. Sure, I'll tell you why. Not long ago. Yes, because she healed them. Have seen this one, and so we just have these two. Greetings, Ophelia. Up for a stroll? Well, well, well. If it isn't the royal tadpole, Sigbert. Pardon? Tadpole, you say? Did I do something to offend you? I have worked long and hard to become one of the chosen ones. Chosen one? Uh, what's that? Ah, you don't even know that. Precisely my point. A chosen one is a rare hero, chosen by fate whom I'll admire. I've trained every day of my life in preparation for being a chosen one. Yes, that's so admirable, but have I done to, what have I what have I done to offend you? 
You're a chosen one by birth. You'll be a king someday without even trying. I might become a king, but it's not fair. I I can't choose the circumstances of my birth, Ophelia. Oh, just forget I said anything. Please, what can I say to... Excuse me, I've got somewhere to... I need to be, Sigbert. Ophelia, I beg of you, stay. I didn't mean to insult you. You know what's awkward to think about? She could easily be a princess of Nor if she was uh, Camilla's daughter. I must thank you for participation in the war meeting, Princess Sakura. Thanks to your efforts to help the injured in our last battle, we were greatly expedited. Thank you, but it wasn't just me. It was all of us working t together. I urge you to accept my gratitude, as well as my apology. I was wrong to say that you weren't suited for the battlefield. You've proven yourself a capable soldier in your own right. Well, I still don't like it, hurting others and being hurt back and all that. I wish the war would just stop, but I can't just close my eyes and hope it passes. Princess Sakura, you're a strong lady. You clearly experience severe anxiety and fear, yet you never let it overcome you. Instead, you find something you can do to help, and you do it with all your heart. Th thank you, Leo. I believe I'll be relying on you more and more in the future, Princess Sakura. You're truly a capable ally. Oh, th thank you. I think I'd like that. Alright, well, I'm also gonna... Yeah, use it on Corrin, I think. And I say that because, um... We're about to get some items soon that I might want to use on some of our characters. Like, we're gonna get some reclassing stuff soon, and, uh... She's coming back. And we'll see you soon enough. That said, I'll see all of you tomorrow. Xander out.